guys. Um, that's going to get started soon. I'll just let everyone in. Um, all right. Perfect. All right. Can everyone give me a big thumbs up if they can hear me? Perfect. All right. We'll get started very shortly. Just adding everyone in. Good to see so many people jumping on today. It's great. All right. All right. So today, uh, I'll start off introducing myself. My name is Lockie. I'm going to be taking a session today. Um, I play for the NBL1 Senior uh, Men's Blues team, all right? So today, uh, we're just going to get lots of shots up, all right? So different shots, working on a little bit of footwork um, and that sort of thing. But to start off with, we need to get warm, all right? So what we need, we don't need our basketball yet, but we will later. So you can sit that to the side. If everyone's got a skipping rope, then that'll be perfect. If you don't have a skipping rope, that's fine. You can just do it on the spot, all right? So I need everyone to grab. If you've got a skipping rope, grab your skipping rope. If not, just skip on the spot, all right? So we're just going to get a warm-up in. So we're going to warm up with a little bit of skipping, all right? And then we'll go shh, get into some shots, all right? I'll just add these couple of people in. Ooh. Perfect. All right. Here we go. So we're going to go for about 30 seconds. We're going to skip four. And then we're going to get into some uh, some other exercises. All right. Here we go. So skip on the spot. If you've got a rope, you can use a rope. If not, just jump up and down on the spot. All right. Put nice and light on your feet. Get nice and warm. Good job. Good work. Try and work on your footwork. Good job. Just straight up and down to start with. Perfect. Good job. All right. And rest for a minute. Now, before we get onto skip, you can sit your skipping rope down. Now, we've just got 10 body weight squats. All right. Straight into 10 body weight squats. Perfect. Doesn't have to be too fast or too low to start with. We're just warming up. All right. Doing 10 of them. Perfect. Good job. All right. Once you got 10, pick your skipping rope back up. Perfect. All right. We're going to skip for another 30 seconds. All right. But this time, when I do a little bit of change up. So for the first uh, 15 seconds, we're going to do high knees as we skip. All right. And then when I say change, I'll say butt kicks. We're going to try and kick our butt up as we're skipping. All right. Ready, here we go. So we're gonna skip, and then we're gonna get our knees up nice and high. All right, perfect. Good job. So you can do this with or without your skipping rope, doesn't matter. Good job. All right, this time, try and kick your heels up. Same thing while you skip. And get your heels up. Good work. Good job, keep going. And rest, all right, this time. Instead of doing 10 body weight squats, we're gonna do 10 lunges. So just five each leg, and just gonna lunge forward, switch legs. All right, just five each leg. You can hold it for a little bit if you need, if you wanna feel a bit of a stretch. We can just bounce straight back up. Perfect. Good job. One more each leg. Perfect. All right, last lot of uh, skipping we got. All right, last lot here. This time, does anyone know Can Can? It's probably called a few different things. So you're done a jump. So as you're skipping, you're done an in, out, and then you're done a swap. 
You're going to do two skips on the one foot. So it's going to be out, but you're kicking your leg out. All right. So we're going to have a go for 30 seconds. Do the can can. All right. Off we go. So we go out, back and forth. I'll go on the side so you can see it. I'll try and go for 30 seconds. All right. Here we go. Good job. Good work. Try and get a rhythm and see how fast you can go. You'll be starting to get nice and warm now. Go for another five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. All right. You can put your uh, skipping rope away this time. Last one here. Just got five each leg, so you got lateral lunge, right? Five each leg, lateral lunge. So we're going sideways. So 10 total. Perfect. You can lean to the side, get a bit of a stretch if you need, or if not, you can just bounce straight into it. Perfect. All right, go one more each way. Perfect. All right, now if you need a quick drink, run and grab a quick drink and then come back and we'll get started into a bit of shooting, all right? All right. Now, if you can, you don't have to, but it helps me if everyone can turn their camera on. It will help me if you're doing it with me so I can watch and uh, give you some, t if I can see. It doesn't matter if you uh, don't want to, that's fine. If you can, or if you've forgotten to, flick your camera on. So that's you guys. Give me the th every Oh. Give me the All right. All right. All right. Here we go. So I'm going to start off with a bit of form shooting. So we always got to start off nice and low, uh, nice and close to the basket. And start with our form shooting. So we're just going to go one hand. All right. So if you're right handed, basketball will be in your right hand. I want your left hand behind your back. Or if you're left handed, Vice versa, left hand, it's got the basketball, right hand behind your back. We're just gonna to go to the side of the hoop if you can, if you've got a hoop. If you don't have a hoop, you can just go on the spot and shoot it straight up and aim for something on the ground, all right? This time we're gonna try and go to the side of the hoop or if you only can shoot from the front, that's fine. So we're gonna aim to make three swishes, all right? We're gonna try and get three swishes. All right, so we're gonna go straight up, that's one. Make sure you hold your follow through for a second. So to yourself, go again. So get, try and get three swishes. All right. I'll be here. Follow through. Aiming for swishes. Nice and soft, straight up. Bend your legs. Try and get that one motion. Just warming up. Warm up that shot. Perfect. I want you to keep going. I'm going to come and have a quick little look, see how you're going. Good job. Perfect. All right. Everyone's doing pretty good this time. Same thing. So I want you to do, so you did three swishes from there. So I want you to try and get three swishes from three spots. So we went this side. Doesn't matter if you can't go. Uh, if you only got one spot of the hoop, that's fine. I want you to try and make nine swishes. So this time I got three. I'm going to go to the front of the hoop now. Try and get three swishes. All right. Same thing, just with the one hand. All right. Make sure to follow through. Use your legs. Once you've got three from the front, I want you to go to the other side that you haven't done.
Perfect. So once you've got three from the front, I want you to come to the other side if you can. If you don't have a hoop, that's fine as well. Just aim for that line on the ground or mark on the ground. Perfect. All right. Once you've got three from this spot, I want you to go straight into, so you can put your second hand on the ball now. You can start at this spot again. This time, all I want you to do, you've done a bit, a bit of balance, all right? So you just want to go on one foot, so you don't have to land, stand on your right foot. I want you to touch your ground straight into your form shot. Follow through, hold it, all right? So if I demonstrate here, I'll be here, stay balanced, straight in. Follow through, all right? You're still aiming for swishes. Aim for swishes, but all you need to do is make three, all right? You're here, touch, stay balanced, just on the right foot, all right? So you're making three here. Once you've made your three, I want you to go to the middle, all right? Perfect. There we go. Once you've got your three, go to the middle. Now, when you're at the middle, I want you to make four, all right? So you're going to make four on your right leg. Uh, sorry, two on your right leg, two on your left leg. All right, so you're going to change legs. Follow through. Aiming for swooshes. Once you made your four total, so two each leg, move to the last spot. And you'll just make your three just off your left leg. I want you to stay balanced the whole time. Follow through. So remember, you're aiming for swishes. You don't have to get swishes, just aim for swishes. Perfect. All right. This time, once you've done that, you're gonna go straight into a bit of touch work, all right? So we're just gonna go between the legs, straight into a little floater, a little touch shot, all right? So we're gonna make three each hand. So you're gonna go three makes with your left, and then you'll put it between the other leg, three makes with your right, all right? One. Make sure we're staying nice and low. as you pop it between your legs and you straight up into your shot. Good job. You got three, perfect. I'm gonna come and have a little look, see how you're going. Perfect. Pop it between your legs, straight up. Good. Perfect. All right, this time, I'm gonna work on a little bit of footwork, a little bit of finishing here, all right? Working on a shot. So this time, same thing. I want you to go try and pop it behind your back, and then you're gonna step and finish with your inside hand. So I'm gonna finish with my right hand on the left hand side. So I'm gonna go behind the back, sort of a reverse layout. All right, gonna make three on the back, Reverse layout. All right. Find the back step. Finish nice and high. Then you'll do the same thing with your left hand. All right. Behind the back. Finish. And then make three. Perfect. And then come and have a look. See how you guys are going. And go behind the back, stay nice and low, finish. Good, perfect. All right, this time, I'm gonna get into some shooting now, all right? So I'm gonna get into, and I go for uh, time this time, all right? So if you wanna come to the camera so you can see, all right, if you got enough room, then, uh, Try and go out to the 45, so which is this sort of angle. If not, if you only got top of the key, sort of like I do, just spin it straight out in front. 
All right. So what we're going to do, work on a little bit of footwork. We're just going to spin it straight out, catch inside foot. So this is my right foot, turn straight into a jump shot. All right. So we're going to go to about, uh, we're going to about the free throw line if you're going straight out. So we're going mid range. So we're just going to spin it, plant with our right foot, turn straight into our shot. All right. We're going to go for time. I want you to see how many you can make in 30 seconds. All right. Ready, off we go. So spin it out, turn with your right foot, shoot it straight up, run back in. The harder you go, the more shots you'll get up, the more shots you can make. Spin it out, make sure you're not traveling, plant, one, two, straight up. Got 10 seconds left. See how many you can make. Three seconds left. Three, two, one. Time. All right. Very good. Hold it there. All right. This time we're going to do the same. We're going to do the same thing. All right. This time you're trying to beat your score from the last time, all right? So you're trying okay. to beat your own score. Kind of spin it out, same thing, only you're gonna plant with the other foot. Left foot, straight up into your jump shot, all right? So if you have enough space to go either side, you can change sides. So you can go out this way if you want. If not, you only got the top of the key like me, just keep going at the top. So we're gonna plant with our left turn, Catch and shoot, all right? We're only go for 30 seconds. See how many we make. Ready, off we go. Spin it out, catch, square up, follow through. Make sure you hold your follow through. See how many you can make. Try and beat your last score. Perfect. Keep going. Make sure we're following through. Work nice and hard. Got 10 seconds left. Last shot. Three, two, one. There we go. Perfect. All right. Everyone, give me the thumbs up if you beat your score from last time. If you beat your score the second time, perfect. That's all right. If you didn't, good job. All right, this time. I'm going to do a similar thing. I'm going to work a little bit of handles in it. So I'm to spin it out. So I'm going to go back to planting on our right foot. So I'm to spin it out. Plant with our right foot. Turn. We're going to do a plant snap between our legs, all right? So it's going to get a little little tricky, but we're going to go plant, one dribble, snap between our legs, straight into our shot, all right? So we're going to snatch it back with our left hand. So from here, one dribble snatch into your jump shot, all right? We're going to go for 30 seconds again, see how many we can make, all right? Ready, off we go. So plant with our right foot, one dribble, snatch it back, follow through. Good job. Make sure we stay balanced. Don't want you to fade away. See how many you can make, 30 seconds. Good, we go, make sure we stay nice and low. Make sure we go straight up and down on our jump shot. All right, got 10 seconds left. Try and get a couple more shots up. 
right, three seconds left. Three, two, one. There we go. All right. This time, same thing. Catch your breath a little bit. All right, this time, same thing. You'll spin it out. Plant left foot now. You'll pivot. One dribble. Snatch it back your right leg. Follow through. Straight up and down. All right. So we're planting with our left leg now. Same thing. Only putting it between our right leg. All right, ready? Try and beat your last score. Off you go. Plant left, one dribble. Catch it back. Follow through. And make sure we stay nice and low, spin it out, plant, one dribble, snatch it back. Make sure we follow through on our jump shots. Perfect, stay nice and low. Got 10 seconds left. Try and get another three shots up. Three seconds, three, two, one. Hold it there, good job. All right, I want you to go, if you've got a free throw line, I want you to go to the free throw line, or if you got a little bit closer, doesn't matter, but I want you to go somewhere roughly where the free throw line is. I want you to shoot two free throws, all right? Take your time, catch your breath, Follow through, hold your follow through for a second, go back to the line, all right? I'm going to shoot two, come back. Then I want you to go get a really quick drink. You've got 30 seconds to grab a drink and come back. All right, give me the thumbs up once you've had a drink and ready to go. Perfect. Perfect. Awesome. All right. This time, I'm going to follow the similar theme of what we're doing on the little spin outs. All right, this time though, we're going to go working on our footwork again into our jump shot. So we're going to spin. This time, we're going to work on our left foot. So we're going to spin it out about the free throw line, plant. We're going to square up. And then we're going to reverse pivot, one dribble into our jump shot. All right. So if you need to go slow to start with, you can. So you're going to square up, reverse pivot, one dribble into your jump shot. All right. So you're going to square up with your left, plant, square up, reverse, one dribble. Follow through. All right, we're gonna go for 30 seconds. See how many you can make. All right, ready, off we go. Spin it out, square up, first dribble. Follow through. All right. Spin it out, square up, first pivot, one dribble, follow through. Make sure you follow through nice and high. Try and get that elbow to the ear. Go make sure you hold that follow through. Got another 10 seconds. Try and get three more shots up. Three, two, one, last shot. Good job. All right, this time we got the same thing. You'll spin it out, plant with your right foot, turn around. I want you to make sure you do a little shot fake. Reverse pivot, one dribble into your jump shot. So if you need to slow down to work on your footwork, I don't mind. Slow it down. So you'll spin it out, 
right plant, shot stake, reverse pivot, one dribble, jump shot. All right, try and beat your last score. All right, ready? Here we go. Spin it out. Work with your right, shot face, dribble into your shot. Make sure you stay balanced. I don't want you fading away too much. Right with your right, square up, take one dribble into your jump shot. Got 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Perfect. Good job. All right. This time, I'm going to start at the front. So instead of starting under the hoop, we're going to start about the free throw line. So all I want you to do is get to the free throw line if you've got it. If you don't, that's okay. Go as far back as you can. Obviously not to the three-point line. All right, just around mid-range, all right? Remember, if you don't have a hoop, you can still do all these drills. Just follow through, try and find a spot on the floor to hit it every time, all right? This time, so I'll do it facing the camera, but obviously I'll be at the hoop. So this time, all I want you to do, spin it to yourself. I want no dip. So I'd, when I say no dip, I don't want you dipping the basketball before you shoot it, all right? So this time I want you to will be facing the hoop, but you're going to spin it. And they catch it sort of in your shot pocket and go straight up. All right. So I don't want you to catch it here in your shot pocket, dip it and go back up. I want you to catch it, shoot it straight up. So you'll be here, catch it here, straight up into your shot. All right. So I'm going to go for 30 seconds. So you'll spin it here, catch straight into your shot, follow through. All right. Now for 30 seconds, here we go. Ready, off we go. Cut, see how many you can make. Run back out, spin it to yourself, keep it high. No dip in your shot, all right? Try not to dip, catch it high, go straight up into it, follow through. Spin it out, catch it high, go straight into your shot. See how many you can make. We've got 10 seconds left. Make sure you keep them follow throughs nice and high. Three seconds left. Get one more shot up. Three, two, one. There we go. Good job. All right, this time, I'm going to be facing the hoop again. But instead of, instead of spinning it to yourself, you're going to start with it. All I want you to do is as, as you bounce it, so as the ball's coming back up, I want you to go straight into your shot. So you're not doing bounce, gather into your shot. You're going straight up into your shot. Not like that. You're going here, straight into your shot. All right, so I'll demonstrate. So from here, I'm just going to pound straight into my shot. All right, I don't want no pause. I don't want no pause from the dribble together. I want you to pound straight up into your shot. So we're going to go for 30 seconds. Make sure we mix our hands up. So you can do two in a row with your right, two on your left, or alternate each time. I don't mind. All right, here we go. Ready, off we go. Straight up into your shot. Pound it nice and hard, gather, straight into your shot. Go try and get a rhythm, follow through nice and high. So we get that energy from the bounce straight into your shot. Make sure you run, grab your ball, come back out, get more shots up. Job, got five seconds left. Five, four. Three, two, 
and one. Hold it there, perfect. All right, this time we're gonna gather a little bit on that. So instead of doing the one dribble into your shot, all right, this time, this time you don't do two dribbles, all right? So it's gonna be bang, bang into your shot, all right? So it's going to be bang, bang, straight into your shot. So two quick dribbles into I'm your shot. So make sure, sure, remember, no, you didn't. I was alternate, uh, <laughs> alternate <laughs> hands. Make sure your microphone's turned off. A couple of you guys and girls have uh, got your mics on. Make sure you keep them off. All right. So we've got two quick dribbles into your shot. Make sure you mix up your hands. All right, ready? Off we go. Straight into your shot. Stay nice and low, so bang, bang, straight up. Try and get a rhythm. I'm getting that power from your bounce. Straight into your shot. Make sure you're changing up hands. Nice and low. Go straight up into your shot. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Time. All right. There we go. All right. This time, I'm going to go back to a little bit of moves into our jump shot, all right? So this time, instead of uh, starting with it, we're gonna spin it back to spinning it to ourself. All right, so we're gonna spin it to ourself, catch on a two foot stop, so on a jump stop, nice and low jump stop. Then I want you to pound it between your legs, one dribble into your jump shot. So I'll be here, so I'll be obviously facing the hoop, but you're gonna spin, catch, one dribble, into your jump shot. All right, so be here, spin it, one jewel into your jump shot. All right, gonna go for 30 seconds, make sure you mix up. So if you go through your right leg, next time go through your left leg. All right, ready, off we go. Spin it to yourself, through your leg, straight up. We stay nice and low. Follow through, hold your follow through for a second. Spin, catch through your legs. Have a little hop with your feet if you need. I want it nice and quick into your shot. You spin it out, legs straight into your shot. Spin it out. Ten seconds left. Here we go. Spin it out. Legs into your shot. Spin it out. Last one. Three, two, one. Time. All right. This time we've got last one here. All right, last one. So this one, gonna do the same thing. And we work on a little bit of handle as well. So you're gonna spin it out to yourself. Catch, I want you to push it, snap through the leg. So you're sort of doing a scissor, so you've got one of each. So you'll be here, go bang, bang, straight into your jump shot. All right, I want it nice and quick. Make sure you mix up your hands. So you'll be here, bang, bang, straight into your jump shot, all right? Going for 30 seconds, see how many you make. Ready, off we go. Spin it out, stay nice and low, follow through. Make sure we try and get that elbow to our ear. We wanna follow through straight up. Spin it out, legs, legs, straight into your jump shot. Spin it out. Legs, legs, 
straight into your jump shot. So I want you to snap it, snap it nice and low between your legs. There you are, legs, legs. There you are. Got five seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. There you go. Good job. All right. So this time, if you've got enough room for a free throw line again, I want you to go to the foul line. All right. You've got, I'll give you, I'll give you two minutes. All right. You've got two minutes. You have to make, try and make at least uh, five free throws in a row. All right. You've got two minutes to try and make five in a row. All right. I'll start the clock. Ready. I'll let you set up. You've got two minutes to make five in a row. Ready. Off you go. Go to your free throw line or thereabouts. Got to try and make five in a row. Keep your same routine, don't need to rush it. Take your time, follow through. Go. Stay nice and low, follow through. Two minutes is plenty of time, so don't need to rush. Got your free throw line, follow through. Try and shoot the same shot. Every time. There you go. Perfect. Still got a minute 20 to go. No need to rush. If you've made your five in a row, I want you to see how many you can make in a row in them two minutes. So if you've already got your five in a row, I want you to keep shooting. See how many you get. All right. If you haven't, no need to rush or panic. Keep calm, take your time, follow through. You got a minute left, you're halfway. Time, follow through. Good job, you got 30 seconds left. Time, see how many you make in a row. Try and at least have to get five. Do your same routine each time. Keep it the same. Even if you miss, don't need to change it. You got 10 seconds left. And time. Hold it there. All right. Come to the camera, give me thumbs up if you got it. Give me thumbs up if you got, perfect, good job. Good job, there we go, perfect. Looks like a lot of you got it, doesn't matter if you didn't. I got eight, after doing the five, I got. I ended up with eight in a row. Good job, there we go, perfect. All right, excellent. Looks like a lot of you guys got it, perfect, all right. That's all the basketball stuff we've got at the moment. All right. We're going to do a little quick little cool down. And then that's us for our session. All right. Trying to do make sure after you do any activity and that sort of thing, you make sure you've got to cool down and look after your bodies. All right. It's really important, especially if we're stuck inside or whatever. You can stretch. All right. So the first one all we're going to do is we're going to do lateral lunge, but we're going to hold it. So instead of lunging and going straight back up, we're just going to lunge. We're going to hold it, stretch our inside of our leg, our groin, and hold it for about 10 seconds. All right. Feel a good stretch. I'm not that flexible. If you can go lower, go lower. If not, find the point that you get a good stretch. All right. Now we're going to change sides. Other side, feel a good stretch. Get to that point and hold that there for a few seconds. Good job. All right, now we're going to go back to the other side. Last one on each leg. 
to get to that point, you should be able to go a little further this time. Feel a good stretch. Perfect. Now I'm going to go back to the other side. Good work. Perfect. Hold that stretch. Good job. All right, this time we're going to do a little hip flexor. So you're going to step forward. So I'll go sideways. So it doesn't matter which leg you step with. I'm going to step forward. I'm going to feel it in your hip flexor. And I want you to lean back. All right, so put your arms straight up. Stretch out, lean back. Hold it for about 10 seconds. Good job. There we go. Stand up. Stretch it out. All right. Now I'm going to do the same on the other leg. So step forward. Stretch it out. Reach back as far as you can. You should feel it in the front of your hip. All right. Feel a good stretch. Perfect. All right. Swap legs again. Last one each leg. Forward this time. Good job. Feel a good stretch. Perfect. Last one on this leg. Stretch it out. Good work. Awesome. All right. Got a couple left. All right. This one, if you need a wall or if you've got a wall or if you're doing it with your brother and sister or someone else, that's fine. You can hold on to something. If not, try and work on your balance. All right. So you just don't go on the side, pull it up. Stretch front of your legs and your quad here. So you're going to hold it for about 10 seconds. If you're having trouble balancing, hold something or you can try and find a spot on the floor or anywhere and you've got to stare at it. Hopefully help you balance. All right. If it's a bit easy, I want to challenge you and try and close your eyes while you do it. All right. Going to swap legs. The same thing this side. If it's easy balancing. You feel a good stretch, I want you to try and do it and close your eyes. If not, hold a wall or hold a someone next to you or something. Perfect. All right, last one on this leg, switch it over. Good job. Perfect. All right, last one on this leg. Good job. All right, our last stretch we've got right, is just our calves. All right, so you can either go to a wall and push against the wall like this. Or if you don't have a wall like myself, you can just go to the ground and go sideways like this. Or front runs, doesn't matter. Just hold it on one calf, stretch it out, hold it for about 10 seconds, and do climb the mountain, walk them out a little bit, and then change legs. Hold that side for 10 seconds. Perfect, walk it out again, and then go back to the other leg. Or if you're on the wall, just push against the wall. Feel that stretch in your calf. Walk it out again. And then last one on this leg. Perfect. Good job. Good job. All right. That's all we've got. Uh, for today's session hopefully you guys had a bit of fun if you've got any questions feel free to ask me anything but uh if not enjoy your Bye. weekend and hopefully you guys are staying Thanks. safe and healthy in lockdown no worries Thanks. see you guys see you guys Bye. good job Bye. good job Perfect, good job.